Hey, what's happening guys? Elton here. I was just making actually a walking video here on St. Laurent Street here in Montreal. Beautiful evening. Today is June 6th and there's these old cars that are set up here. I think it's for uh, maybe the Italian festival, St. Laurent Street Festival. I don't know what to do, whatever. But look at that. This fucking thing's begging me to make it, to immortalize it because the way the sun is hitting, the sun's getting lower and the shine and the orange stripes and circa 78, 79, 80, 81. Wow. Preferably when it comes to this and the Firebird Trans Am, I prefer the front of the Trans Am. However, that being said, actually, you know what? I just realized something. This is a 78 or 79 because I think the, I think like the Caprice or the Impala in 80, it was the same body, but the sides were all, unfortunately, they were all smoothed out. There was no more crease. I know because I had a 78 Caprice and it had the same crease down the middle like that. And I love that. And then GM, well, they kind of screwed the pooch on that, and they're like, no, no more crease. Cost too much money. Yeah, it's probably a good old 350 in there. It's funny, the plate actually is written Z28. It's not even personalized either. Something tells me, though, that this car uh, surely was repainted, but I'm not really sure if it's, very, if it's really original, though. I mean, obviously, those wheels were changed God knows when. God, she is fucking mint. Looking at this thing, I'm thinking it's worth at least 15, 20 grand. But some of these cars are even going for more than that because they were the last of their era. And some people would agree with me that the cars that replaced these, they weren't as good and they weren't as cool. No offense to anybody who has them. It's just, you know, this to me or even the guy next to me looking at it, this is a symbol of my youth when people had these all over the fucking city. I mean, like anywhere, you know? Look, there's even uh, the dash is mint. Wow. Never liked those steering wheels, though. They put those on everything. Even those GMC Chev Astro vans. That, that is an outstanding example. I think that's probably the nicest Z28 of its time I've ever seen. Uh, beautiful uh, skirt, uh, skirt package there. Crown effects. And... Uh, that's an interesting touch with the uh, electrical tape, it looks like, on the headlights. I could be wrong, but... What an automobile. What an automobile. I mean, don't get me wrong, the Preludes and all these cars are nice, but this is just... This is the stuff fucking dreams are made of. This is what people dream to, uh, uh, to own, you know? Let alone see. Look at the interior, it's immaculate. No, this car I'm wrong. Now I'm looking at the interior. This car was completely restored and beautifully restored on top of it. Let me just get one last shot of it because I cannot believe that this thing is just here. It's almost like I said, it was just here for me to just immortalize the moment, you know? And I want to get one more shot here. Check that out. Hey, ooh, I like that, man. Yeah, man. Jesus Christ. Stock car, man, you know? Anyway, uh, so it is what it is, or as we say in French, it's okay. So, so you guys take it easy. Hope you enjoyed it. T tops, rock on. Bye bye. Talk about a vanishing act. <laughs>